and he spent two-fifth of his money while Ben spent three-eighths of his money. Then they each had 120s left. The question wants to know how much did the two boys have all together at first? So we are finding the amount of money at first. So to do so, I need to find out both for Andy and Ben the total sum of money that they have spent and left. So how do I do so? Let's take a look at the fraction. If Andy had spent two-fifth, that means he would have three-fifth left. How did I get that fraction? I used one whole to subtract two-fifth and I get three-fifth. Same thing goes to Ben. If Ben spent three-eight, that means the $120 would be equivalent to the fraction of 5 8. So now taking a look at that, $120 is equal to how many parts for Andy? $120, it will be equal to 3 parts. And the bottom, which is the denominator, which is 5 units, is the total, which we are finding. And same goes to Ben. We are going to find for Ben 8 units and 120 is equal to 5 units. So I can do this in 2 steps. So let's go to Andy first. I will take 120 divided by 3 to find 1 unit and then I multiply by 5. I will get my answer as 200. Now let's move on to Ben. For Ben, he has 120 left as well. but that $120 is equal to 5 units. So I will divide by 5 to find 1 unit. And then I multiply by 8. And I will get the answer of 192. Then the question wants how much did the two boys have all together at first? So my last step is adding the two 192 and 200 together. And I will get $392. And that's my final answer.